Okay, um, I would like to uh, give you some um, a tip regarding how to solve the um, Twitter API version 2 problem. So the main reason for this problem is uh, Twitter has updated their API to version 2, but uh, the community of Node-RED has not developed any uh, node that works with uh, Twitter you know, uh, API version 2. And uh, what I did, I basically developed uh, a node that um, works with uh, API version 2. So you can just use your better token uh, to interact with uh, with um, API version 2 with from uh, Node-RED environment. So I'm going to just show you uh, how you can uh, update your Twitter in uh, Node-RED and um, basically solve this problem. So um, in Node-RED environment, basically, as you can see, uh, you have um, Twitter in and Twitter out as your nodes. If you don't have, you can just install it. And um, the way you do it, you just go to your Node-RED uh, folder. I'm opening a terminal here. I have a terminal open. So, uh, and um, I'm just, go to the Node-RED uh, basically directory usually you know the Node-RED directory is uh, in, in, if you're a Mac user basically or Windows user is the same so you can find where your Node-RED is installed and go to that folder if you don't have the Twitter uh, node you can just install by um, npm install node red node twitter it should install the you know node red nodes if you uh, the twitter nodes if you don't have them so um i already had them so i just reinstalled so you know how you can install it uh so uh after this uh what you need to do you just go to my github repository this is the address uh, of the GitHub. And I put the code there. So you go to this URL and uh, just download the code, uh, download a zip file. And um, yeah, I have the file downloaded here. So uh, what I'm gonna do, I just open where the Node-RED node Twitter is installed. Okay, so this is my Node-RED folder. So you should have a similar folder as well. So um, <clears throat> if you go to your Node-RED folder, either if you're a Mac user or, or a Windows user, uh, in node modules, you know, where uh, all nodes actually are um, located, and if you find the node red node Twitter, which, yeah, it's here on top. So this is node red node Twitter. If you go to the, uh, you know, to that folder and you can just delete all these files here and um, go back to your zip file that you downloaded from uh, GitHub. So this is the folder and just copy and paste everything in the folder, copy them and paste them in, into this node, red node, Twitter folder. So it's done. And uh, now if you go basically and restart your node reds because node red needs to be reloaded right so i'm going to just control c here and run node red again so it reloads and starts um node red so i'm going to just refresh it again okay so 
if you go to this Twitter nodes, you don't see the Twitter out. I just removed it uh, for this version that I created for public tweets. And I just added one Twitter in node, which is with a darker uh, dark or green color here. So if you bring this node in, and I'm gonna just put a uh, D-box so you see the output. And uh, if you double click, you will see, actually I removed all the you know options. It's just public tweet option here. And uh, you can just search for a single term. So you cannot basically search for multiple um, tags or uh, keywords, it's just single. I think for your assignment, this should work. So I'm going to just put, for example, BMW here. And uh, if you go to uh, the configuration part, you can put basically your Twitter ID here. And you just need to copy and paste your better token uh, in your Twitter account. Uh, basically, let me show you. You should have seen that. Um, Okay, I'm going to show you where your token is located. So, um, yeah, this is basically the API. And if you go to your user authentication setting, open it. Um, no, sorry, to, to keys and tokens. So here you see basically the bearer token. If you uh, just copy and paste this bearer token, I'm going to regenerate it and copy the bearer token and put it here. And I think it's uh, for my other account. So I just update the name of the uh, Twitter ID actually, and uh, let's deploy it. So when you deploy it, you will, uh, takes a bit of time until it starts yeah, receiving. And when it receives, you get this uh, green dot here and you can see basically it's tweeting, it's collecting tweets about um, the, the keyboard that is provided. So uh, this is basically how you can make it work and then finish your assignment. I hope that works for everyone. If you face any technical challenges, just uh, let me know. Good luck.